Hi there, welcome back to my channel for English learning. And today, I'm outside. In today's video, we're going to be looking at British English and American English to talk about the car. So together with a friend of mine from the US, we're going to look at vocabulary for the car and I'm going to hand you over to my friend John, who's going to give you some American English. As Steve just said, I'm John and I'm going to tell you what car parts are called in the United States in American English. Hood, license plate, bumper, fender, and headlight. Windshield, windshield wiper. Side view mirror, steering wheel, stick for a manual car, emergency brake, parking brake, or handbrake. This glove compartment. This car doesn't run on diesel. It runs on gasoline or gas. It doesn't have a gas cap. Turn signal. Tail lights. Bumper. Quarter panel. And the trunk. So there you go. That's what we call these car parts in American English. Now Steve is going to tell you what they are in British English. Right, dude? Right. Thanks, John. Okay, so now back in Britain, and let's review the same vocabulary in British English. I'm going to start with the bonnet. Here we have the front bumper, the license plate or the number plate. This part here is called the wing and the headlight. This is the windscreen and the windscreen wiper. Here we have the wing mirror and of course we have one on the other side as well. Okay so on the interior of the vehicle here we have the rear view mirror, we have the steering wheel on the right because we're in the UK and in Britain we drive on the left and the steering wheel is on the right unlike John's car. Down here we have the gear stick and just behind that we have the handbrake or the parking brake, normally we call it the handbrake, and also the glove box. Over here on the uh, rear wing we also have the uh, petrol cap. This car is petrol, we also do diesel here in the UK, but this is a petrol car. Okay, here we have the indicator flashing away. Okay, here at the back we also have the rear lights, we have the rear bumper, the rear wing, and of course, we have the boots. Well, that's about it for this video. I hope you found it useful. Um, if you have any doubts or comments, please leave them in the comments below. Well, that's it for me. I'll see you soon. Good.